we're out of gas. <laughs> we're out of gas. <laughs> we are. We're out of fucking gas, man. <laughs> we are. How far from there? An hour. An hour from there, and we're really out of freaking gas. <sighs> we are forever grateful to these people who found us and gave us some gas. I guess that's part of the reason they survive out here. They help one another. Gracias! Thank you! The next morning, you can see where two rivers meet. They have two different colors. Meanwhile, back in the engine room, there seems to be a few little problems. I'm sure it's nothing too serious, so we do some more exploring by the skiff. Even though the forest is flooded, you can see how the water is dropping. What is he doing up there on the tree that has no leaves? He's full. These macaws are members of the parrot family. Around each corner brings something unexpected. The cure to countless diseases could be found within the jungle and its people. I had a fever. <laughs> you had a fever. Rosa put limes on my forehead, wrapped in a towel. My fever was gone in about 10 minutes. <laughs> okay, girls, go first. Today we're going to explore in the actual jungle, so we brought along someone who lives nearby. We quickly realize how lucky we are to have experienced people of the jungle like Gerson and Miguel with us. That'll, oh, yeah, that'll hurt you good. Grab it real hard, then. The jaguar is the king of the jungle around here. Jaguar track. Last night? Yeah. For the people who live here, the jungle is the pharmacy. But how we prepare? Now they mix this tree sap with orange juice to help deal with the parasites from the water in their stomachs. Parasite for the children. Takes care of the fever? For the flu. The whole forest floor seems to be moving. Alright, we're gonna go around the tree. This tree is called the jungle telephone, and here's why. We understand you just whack this a few times, sit and wait for somebody to come and get you. Gerson's guide company takes his name from these hard-working leaf-cutter ants. They made a hole for the house and they made a road. The middle, they carry the leaf. The big one, they are the soldier. They made many cuts like this. And this one's a rubber tree. This is the birth control. Apparently they have their own morning after pill. And if you're thirsty, you just gotta know where to look. Looks like that jaguar did find something to eat after all. It's back on the river, and we're soon reminded why they call this a rainforest. These are the giant Amazon water lilies known as Victoria Amazonica. Spider? Spine. This is a special day for us because Gerson, Miguel and Rosa are going to take us to their own village. We float in over their football field and arrive in their community center. Miguel shows us how a blowgun works. We buy a few of the handmade crafts, and we bought a blowgun too. David and Adam try out the canoes. We proudly pose for a picture with the whole village. Barbarita? I did. These are Miguel's beautiful daughters. Now it's back to the boat, but there's trouble. Can't be good. Uh, engine problems. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the was going, uh, and all of a sudden, uh, so we're gonna see what they come up with. We're launching the skiff. They're gonna go find something. What's that in Spanish? I don't speak the language, but I was. It means not very good.